Ooh. I had to move Grogu. Not Grogu. Not Grogu. Yeah, I had to move him out of the way because I was going to just whack him with this. Um, So this is my belt. There it is. <laughs> so I think we uh, about a month ago, we probably teased. Um, we talked about the fact that I was getting a belt. This is my kicking cancer's ass uh, belt. And it was gifted to me by the folks at 2PW. And mm. I absolutely adore it. Um, I don't know if there's all kinds of things to read on it. And um, absolutely the one of the coolest things I have ever received in my life. Um, it's purple, which I love. And it's legit. And I feel pretty badass carrying it around. And I should probably just start wearing it everywhere I go. Um, I did take it to the Penguins game last night because I wanted to show my coworkers and, of course, take my very cool belt to the game in the arena and i took a couple pictures out there mm. which was pretty cool <laughs> before the game started i mean the game didn't go so well but i had my belt so that was that was fun and um everybody was thought it was really just amazing to see and uh one of my bosses over at the pens is, is a big wrestling fan and i was like i got something you want to see and he was like mm, when wasn't didn't think it was gonna be as cool as what i had mm -hmm. um but yeah this is i i love it um and we ended up in a conversation about it last night uh, with, with somebody who recognized the type of belt, and they asked if it was from Undisputed Belts, and it is. And it's it, it's really, really nice. And like I said, I love it quite a lot. And um, took it to see family recently. We went to Saris's to get um, ice cream with a family that was in from Vegas, and uh, they were all pretty impressed with the nice. belt. Because I was like, look at this. And just put it on the table. And they were like, that's so cool. Because they didn't. I don't think you, they expected it to be quite as cool as, as it is. But Yeah, we well, probably people were expecting, like, people were probably used to seeing, like, the Mattel WWE belts, right? Mm -hmm. You know, and then to, to see an actual, like, like full-on belt. I mean, that is, I mean that, that belt is, you know, other than... You know the, the the visuals and everything on it is is pretty much like it's got the it's got the the uh, plates on it and uh, I don't know that it's leather necessarily but it's like it's comparable to what you see if you go to like an indie wrestling show and a lot of the championship belts pretty much look like that right mm -hmm. so it snaps I can wear it <laughs> oh not that Velcro crap like WWE does now huh nope <laughs> so <laughs> snaps <laughs> that's a real one that's a real one awesome. And you said you said bonus. It matches your uh, jersey from the pens, huh? Yes, I, I am going to wear them together. You could be like a dress and uh, belt combination. There you go. Going on. There you go. But yeah, Full so it's definitely theme. super cool. And I thought I, I handled it pretty well when they gave it to me in the ring. I was like, oh, it looks like I've done this before. <laughs> Uh, I, I do love there was a call out for you to step out over the ropes the first time because you have done that before. So, I have. Um, um, uh, 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 giant style, I guess we could say. <laughs> so, <laughs> yes, my legs are long enough to step over the top rope. <laughs> hey, Sha Shaquille O'Neal didn't even get that when he uh, got in the ring a couple months ago. <laughs> so, <laughs> he stepped through, and you know, Shaquille Shaq's like, you know, what, seven feet tall. And you had uh, Paul White, the Big Show, it like was literally back. Like was, there's footage of him literally backstage watching the monitor, saying, "Well, so much for being a giant, Shaq." So, because <laughs> so, like you know, one of those like unintended rules. Like, listen, if you're over like six five, you step over the damn rope. Uh, so, because <laughs> show that you're a big person. It's a requirement, right? So, but uh, and you're like the tallest lady near a wrestling ring, I think. Well, obviously, we know another one. That's about the, the <laughs> that's also uh, very tall, but it's like you know you are the giant of wrestling <laughs> ladies, you know comparatively. So um, that's awesome. So uh, and uh, as I said there's some footage and some pictures over on uh, shout out to Prospect Pro Wrestling and uh, Marshall Gambino over there, right? Mm -hmm. so. Oh gosh, yeah, that was this is by far one of the coolest. I I I, I think I described it as like a bucket list item I didn't know I had. <laughs> <laughs> Because you never, I never, would never have guessed this. Katie and, and uh, Katie, other than like the championship, like Chachi plays like second place for Mario Kart, that Missy one, we don't even own a belt. Yeah, you know? <laughs> so, like we, it's, you know, we just it haven't even happened. So that's uh, awesome. And now, yeah, now you got to show that because I saw him in the chat room. Wheels, who is a belt, avid belt collector, you're going to have to visit him down there in West Newton when they start running shows again. So absolutely um, <laughs> awesome. And she'll be wearing that on the show every week. Uh, <laughs> I can go 
going forward, you will see the belt every time I'm on the show. Excellent, <laughs> excellent. If you haven't yet, you know, uh, if you're on the audio version, go check out the videos at Two PW on Twitter and Prospect Pro Wrestling on the Facebook, on the Instagram, um, and uh, you can see the footage and uh, the pictures. And um, we're gonna have to do something. We we have, you did a little bit of a photo shoot. Maybe we'll have to do something with that here uh, in a little bit too. I was just just putting those pictures together to send over to the guys at Two PW. So um awesome 